Welcome everyone to HFN, also known as Houston News. Today is January the 24th, 2021. We're going to give you all an update on Loop Ring. It's been a while, so we felt like we need to go ahead and update each and every one of you about the prospects of where the price is going to go right before the trap takes the market there. Now, if this is your first time watching our video, make sure before you go, hit the like button, share the video. Also, you want to subscribe and tap that bell. You want to tap that bell so you make sure you become notified whenever we upload our predictions to this channel now if you want to see our stock predictions you'll have to go on over to our second channel Houston news to stocks in order to see those predictions we felt it would be a better idea for us to segregate the markets between the cryptocurrencies and stocks so you guys can see it right here the last time we did our video in loop ring was on the 6th of january let me zoom in and we expected the market in loop ring to give us some weakness and that is precisely what has occurred matter of fact the weakness came through the next day on the 7th of january the ultimate tp was about 16.84 percent so the market grabbed that uh, area of our ultimate tp price the next day so we're not surprised to see the trap actually take the price that low as a matter of fact it took a lot lower than our prediction um you can see right here that the market ultimately came all the way down on the 11th of January, which would have been about 38% market movement to the downside. And since then, Loop Ring has been trading sideways. So congratulations to those who was able to capitalize on that weakness in the beginning of January. Now it's over. It is done. We move on. We got to get in position in his next play so that we can capitalize on that. So you guys can see we had this ascending line, right? We was tracking the overall strength in the market in loop ring and it was very very strong during these three days on the third fourth and the fifth of january the market strength in loop ring was massive and since then it has been trading relaxed the market in loop ring is simply trading sideways so it gives us the opportunity to gauge what the trap is trying to do so what we're going to do we're going to take this line now and we're going to utilize it as the trend that the trap is going to try to take the price okay so now you guys can still see that the market in loop rank is pretty much trading sideways so let me just give you a visual depiction of this real quick okay so this is the visual depiction in the market in loop ring the market is just trading within this channel which is not bad it's not negative what it really shows us is that the trap is complacent with keeping the transactions and the participation of the market between 35 cents and 45 cents which is you know a 10 cent gap now let's look at the market in loop ring real quick on the three-day time frame you guys can see here that the market still looks pretty good i mean especially over the next six hours this market in loop ring on this current three-day price bar close towards the high it still lets us know that the strength and loop ring is still being maintained okay based off the last three day price bar the market did get weak but we recovered from that weakness so the market is maintaining the strength this is what the trap is telling us so we're already seeing the fact that if anything this market and loop ring is going to maintain this strength and the continuation of trading sideways now let's move on and take a look on the weekly time frame and then we'll go ahead and let you all go so even on the weekly time frame you can see a little bit better that the strength into the market and loop ring also is here too okay now the current weekly price bar and loop ring you all are seeing that the market is a wash there's no one dominated the market whether it is strength or weakness what we're seeing is simply a wash it's balanced so that kind of coincides with the market continuing to trade in that same way uh, sideways trading fashion okay so we're going to continue to, to have our support area around 35 cents and the restriction area around 45 since this weekly price bar has given us that the market is a wash to let us know that the market is still undecided in which way it wants to go right on the weekly time frame so on the three-week time frame you guys can see here that this has been monumental volume like we've seen an increase either in buyers or sellers and a lot more people have been placing their eyes on this particular market due to the volume since it has been trading on the binance exchange 
it hasn't seen this much volume at all. So we'll definitely have to pay attention to this in the long term because the market in loop ring currently is closing well off of the highs. So that could definitely mean that there were a lot more sellers into the market, something that we need to keep watchful of as we continue to see this market trade throughout February. OK, but let's go ahead and do this real quick. I think there is a little bit more strength into the market that we can play on for loop ring. And that is going to be our forecast. OK. We're going to go ahead and get rid of that ascending line. And we're going to put in a forecast into the market for loop ring to give us some strength. OK. Now, the ultimate area support is going to be right here at 35 cents. If the price breaks that, then we already know that our forecast is incorrect and we need to let it go. Right. Preferably, we would definitely like to see the trap hold price well above 42 cents or 40 cents. Excuse me. That is where we want the trap to show us that he's willing to prop up the market right there around 40 cents. Because if he does, then we definitely understand that that 45 cent area that is acting as restriction is going to be tested. He's going to try to test the market to see if he can break it up above that price level. OK, so what we're going to do, we're going to lower this down just a tad. OK, around 37 and a half cents for support. And obviously we would TP the market in loop ring right here around 45 because we have already established that that was the last opportunity that the trap ran across some resist restriction, i.e. just more sellers were there. OK, so we would TP there around 45 cents, but I'm going to take it up just a tad towards 48, 49. All right. So this is it. It's not hard. It's not complicated. We are already expecting the market to continue to give us a little bit of strength. And we already told you where our TP price would be. And now for you, it's your turn. What are your thoughts about loop ring? Whether you think the trap is going to take the price, because either way it go, if you don't agree with what we stated, you have to get in a position in your own thesis. So where do you see the market in loop ring going over the next, I will say three weeks, where will price be in three weeks? Because either way, we need to try to take the bag. We need to try to take the profits back from the trap because he's laying out the market to try to place us in some very bad positions. So we got to be watchful of what he does. So let everyone else know in our comment section about what you think about loop ring and where we're headed. And that's it. Make sure you maintain the profitability. You know, you know, go and just trade different.